I'm starting the recording. Welcome yeah. to Atlantia, and I'm DM Mig, and these are my and these are my players. Odin. Playing Svara, a ninth dimensional amnesic angel. Antonio. Playing Poke, a they, they, they playing Poke a character, a, 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 a character, specifically a, a, a specifically a bird. Sean. <laughs> playing Tenuriath, a high elven uh, tomb raider who is really pretty sure she, nobody gets to call her crazy anymore. And Amanda. The Fey Amanda, who is ready to be called crazy by every single sea person she meets. And our players are are newly are newly rescued onto the sea fo onto the sea people ship, Moonslip, which is a which is a small which is a small uh kind of kind of uh, long paddleboard like uh like re uh, glowing amberish crystalline ship. Uh, with a reed hut built onto it that is bigger on the inside than it is on the outside, and it uh, the moonslip is currently glowing and uh, and and rising up into the into the atmosphere, away from the island of Oceanus's forge, where our uh, where where our where our heroes have just have just left, uh, pursued by three gnomish warships, uh, that are that are that are are. That are firing on, that are currently firing on you. Uh, immediately in, immediately in front in front of you, is the, immediately in front of you is the uh, is is the cat is the captain, uh, who's named Captain Ray, and he wears a he wears a, a he wears a brown a brown bowler cap, and uh, as do as do all of the uh, all of the crew members, of the uh, of of Moonslip. Uh, and he's he's stepping he's stepping down stepping down a, a set of a set of stairs, towards uh, towards two other towards two other uh, two other uh, crew members, who are currently seated, at a, who are currently seated. Uh, one is seated at a bench, and the other is seated on a uh, on on a small on a small blo small block of uh, a small block of wood that looks like a container of some kind. Um, both of them are scribbling furiously. On uh, on a small on a small sheet of glass, uh, of the same amber glass that the that the floor is made of, uh, and and the, every and they're wincing every once in a while. Might as well be right on the floor. Uh, he, they look at, the the captain the captain turns around turns around and lo look turns around and looks at, looks back at you. And sa and says. Oh, splendid, splendid! We're uh, we're making it, we're making it up into orbit. Uh, you can you can look right you can look right there and see, and you look at and uh, you and as you turn to turn around to look, uh, the the kind of reed basket that that had served as the door that you came in through, uh, looks like looks like it 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 slides down into the floor, and you can see outside. Uh, the the world falling away falling away behind uh, uh, behind you. Uh, you can you can see uh, you can see a, a a huge expanse of ocean, and a and a large uh, and a and a, a large limb of land uh, that ha that is separated from a from a larger continent around the uh, that's around the edge of the planet. Uh, uh, separated by by some water, going down and ending in a long peninsula. Uh, the planet is the the planet Terra is uh, is tw is slow is slowly turning below you as you get higher and higher and see the uh, and see the planet receding below you. Uh, you do see th you do see three three large rectangular re rectangular uh, shapes pursuing pursuing you. Uh, and eat, and every one, every once in a while, a, a bolt of a bolt of magical energy comes fl comes flying from one of them toward towards you. Uh, almost, but because because of the great speeds involved, they seem to be approaching you in slow motion. Uh, the the uh, moonslip is easily is easily dodging back and forth. Uh, but and these gargantuan bolts of energy. By the time they get to you, seem to be all two or three times the size of the ship as they go as they go sailing by. Uh, 
as, with ease. Some of them look some of them look like they're uh, look look like they're uh, like like they're almost close enough to reach out and touch. That's not good. He look the the captain the captain look, looks at, looks at all of you and, and looks at all of you and, sa and and says so um uh what 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 what's the next move? I was told I was told you I was told you would have the answers. Oh, <clears throat> lied to. We got a whole lot to stuff to do, and you are a sketchy sketchy man. So if you if you just like excuse us, we'd like to. Um, explore this humble abode that you have here. Yeah, um, sorry. Uh, we're missing the three logical ones. Um, you're currently with the four dummies. Hey, well, I'm, not, I'm not a dummy. Who are you calling dummy, dummy? I'm calling you a dummy, dummy. And it takes a dummy to know a dummy. Well, <laughs> um, if I may, if I may be so bold as to uh, as as to wonder uh, why I would set you loose on on my ship, uh, uh, yes, if uh, if you find us strange and queer, actually, that might be the best. That might be the best thing. If you think if if you think we're if you think we're weird, perhaps the best way for you to understand us is to take a tour, take a self guided tour of the ship. I think we will. Shakti, Shakti, behind you, mumbles un, under her breath. That's not foreboding or anything. Bird boy, what do you think of this? Uh, I think this is a good idea. I'm just going to take this opportunity to point out the fact that we had our own ship. It was perfectly safe. There was nothing weird or freaky as hell about it. I'm just going to put that out there. I'm just going to say it. Said, so says, things that are weird and freaky and freaky as hell are the things that bring us closer to our utmost goal. So he they said, want to be with the queers. The captain said. The no. captain says, "If you wish, I can take you back." No. Uh, we're, we're already knee deep, Tenerith. I have feather fall. I can jump. Past knees. Oh, like Moonslip would would like Moonslip would ever allow would ever allow us to be so rude as to uh, as, as to as to drop a, a drop a, a a pass a passenger off 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 in orbit, who was not uh, who was not able to to travel under their own power. Yeah, we're in space right now, Tenerife. Wait, what? Yeah. Huh? When and, oh, when did that happen? So turn 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 around and look, turn around and look. That's not right. That's not right. I'm seeing things. I think I ate one of my fermented ones. I'm sorry. As can we see the can we see a posset from here? Uh, no, because you are because you are you're in orbit. This is this is your uh, this is your view right now. What a view! Oh yeah, the 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 windows got some rendering issues on them. <laughs> Yeah, it does. They're, they're quite, um, quite short. Yeah, so... Very wide, but short. But this, but this is, but that, that's what, that's what you see. And there, and there's three, uh, there, and there's three black rectangles following you that are, that are shooting red energy at you. Oh, that's not, that's, that's, that's probably, probably bad. Only they just spoil. I suggest that we explore this um, place that we have here. Well, I mean, we are being pursued. I don't know what to do about that. Oh, mm, shoot him! The captain. Sa the captain says, "Let me worry about. Let me worry about the the pursuit. If you really, if if you're real, if you're really disinterested in." If you're really disinterested in, uh, in, in, uh, in, in working with us, then go, ha go and learn about us. Have fun. No, I have a question no. about you. Why are you even here in the first place? Like, why did you come and, like, save our asses? I was sent. 
By who? I was sent by a by a cup by a couple of friends of yours. Who? Which oh, friends? No. I'm digging deeper, guys. A couple of friends that were le- that were uh, that that were left on 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 another world who helped me escape. Help, and then he ter- turns and says, all. "Well, helped us escape. Like the the whole ship was in, was in trouble, and you know they." And in order to, in order for me to, uh, shall we say, uh, get the ship out, uh, to enlist the the cooperation of uh, of of a, a necessary person, shall we say, um, I, um, I uh, might have double crossed someone and told them that uh, I would help you in return. Okay. So my some friends of mine helped you, and I pro and I was probably there because, uh, but I probably don't remember it, um, because I, you know, fr- friends of friends of yours, I I friends of yours, no no, uh, friends of uh, friend, oh, oh, friends oh. of uh, fr- fr- friends of friends of this of this one, and uh, and Which one? points at and points at poke. Oh, bad boy, what did you do? I had, I, there, I, it wasn't just me that got out of the Feywild before it imploded on itself. What was that? Who, who, who were you with? Uh, there was this, uh, there, there was this, uh, witch lady. There's this, and, and her husband. Uh, there's, uh, uh, who was it? Uh, there was, uh, there, there was Nilla. And then Tenarius, um, uh, who, and, 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 uh, and Poke, and, and Poke, uh, lightly taps uh, Tenarius' shoulder, and asking, who else was there? I don't know, y'all look the same to me. <laughs> you say that to the tiny, freaking fairy compared to the tall angel lady. I'm actually not that tall. I'm actually like five foot six. Compared to Amanda, you're tall. Fair. So, uh, so the, so the cap, the captain, the captain sa- says, actually, there was a, there, there was a, uh, there, there was a, an elv an elvish gentleman, uh, a, a, uh, a, a cobbler, uh, as I, as I recall, who, uh, who was a who was a, of a certain person's a, a certain person's acquaintance? Uh, Bozo Bonzo, what, what was his name? I remember Bonzo. <laughs> Bozo Bonzo. Bozo is crazy. <laughs> he said, and he was a kobold. Yes. All right. Uh, let's get down to business. <laughs> so if you so if you don't so if, if you so if you if you wish you can you can I, you can you are free to exit the ship should you wish you are not being kept here under any duress, uh, or you can go you can go and uh, and and survey the ship and fi- and find for yourself uh, what the uh, find for yourself find for out for yourself what the, what what our ship stands for. Moonslip is uh, quite an interesting name, so yeah, I think we'll do that. I right, guess. Okay. Yeah, let's go. Let's All right. it. I take one look at him before we leave, and I'm just like analyzing his face. I'm like, what? It's a goofy, goofy grin right there. <laughs> a villainous grin, if you might say. Joker-looking ass. Mm-hmm. Why so serious? <laughs> Moonslip, moonslip, moonslip only watches, but we go and we go and and do and do as, as we wish. None hinder us, and we bring light everywhere that we go. It's uh, well, the moon, light. Okay, sure. Moon kind of looks like an eye. Of, slip of the moon. All right, sure. All right, I can get behind. He's a doppelganger. All right, let's uh, see this uh, dungeon. I mean, uh, ship. Oh, 
well, they're shape cha they're changelings at least. So, uh, so that anyways, what I'm trying to say is, he, is he's, is he's, is he's trying to deceive us and, and lure us into a trap. Mm -hmm. But yeah, let's go down there so he doesn't suspect a thing. I'm saying this to the party, not uh, not him, like mm -hmm. privately. You're expecting me. Amanda sticks her hand into her flower and comes, and her hand comes back out with, with five uh, fermented honey cake. Actually, and like sticks my hand on. Actually, your actually your flower does not open. What? Excuse me. In this place, yeah. your flower does not open. But I need my honey cakes to get service. So you re <laughs> you reach for your flower you reach for for your flower and your hands just boom boom, and you you and you you pry you pry it open and it's just and it's just it's just you know some pollen coated pistols sticking out. Alright, what did you do to my flower? You are inside a you are inside an al an alternate. An alternately sized space, my my dear. Unfortunately, the the portal to, the portal in, into your flower will not operate until you exit the ship. Remember, I would... Amanda, interdimensional space in an interdimensional space it doesn't really really work. So. Oh, yeah, right, I'll make a black hole. How, however, if, however, if you, however, if you if if you insist, we can we can land somewhere at, somewhere with air so that you may disembark. Simply tell fine. us. Simply tell us where you wish to go, and we will take you there. I'm let's, fine. Let's do that like after we, you know, this do, is do honey cakes. Stop with the honey cakes. Tenerius, <laughs> is gonna want. It's gonna be. Is gonna want the honey cakes too. I imagine. <laughs> the sound of the place, yeah. All right, let's go. <laughs> the captain, the captain le leads you, leads you, leads you down the, uh, leads you down the, uh, the amp, the amber, uh, amber crystal stair, uh, walkway, uh, between the, between the two, the two crew members who, uh, one of whom is sitting at a, at a, at a, a table that is strewn with all manner of, st with all manner of, of strange and exotic items, uh, that look like, that look like the, they're from vastly different civilizations materials uh pieces parts of things just let just laying on tables there's a uh, there there's ha there's half of a golem lying on lying on one, lying on one of them with uh with, with the with the uh, large chest plate open and you can see and you can see uh, nodes of glowing crystal along the inside uh and then then right then right next right next to Right next to it is a uh, is an aquarium full of sand that you can see something you know mounding around it you know almost ro rolling around on the inside making a little mound of the sand uh, next to it. Uh, it's very it's really loaded, right? You're loaded, right? Don't you have like a lot of money? Not that anyone knows. Oh. Out of character, there's a lot of like expensive, cool items. Uh, and and the cat, the captain, wa the captain walks that walks you past, uh, walks you past, uh, and in a, a long table, uh, full of all, full of all of these of these strange items, and uh, and then ma makes a right hand turn, and and uh, and shows you the shows you the entrance to a uh, the entrance to what look what looks like the next room beyond and you can see you can see through through that archway there's another archway that has a room beyond and another archway that has a room beyond and another one and another one another one and it stretches out as far as you can see don't walk through that he look he looked he looked the the captain says oh it's quite safe and he and he and he's he ste he steps through it in, into the, into the next room and says it's just the beginning of the tour. Okay. However, you will you'll you'll find you'll find some you'll find some things in 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 each room. But you know, there's but the far the farther you go, the more shall we say, exotic, uh, the things that you will find. How many rooms are there? 
I'm sorry, what? How many rooms are there? <laughs> yes, quite. You're very funny. You're very funny. <laughs> I know, I know. Uh, so free, feel feel free. Um, I'm sure you'll be. I I imagine you'll be able to uh, to to find your way back. Yes. Do when we get back, is there a way we can like skip all the rooms that we went through, or do we have to go through each and every room again to get back? Uh, well, I mean, you never know where you never know which room a doorway is going to take you into. So you know you can you, you can certainly look and you can see the. Uh, you can see the path ahead of you, but you oh, simply okay. you simply have to uh, have to have to think of of what you're looking for, and the and the doorway will take you there. That's quite good. So basically, every single doorway is a literal door. Way. Well, no, no, no. I mean, it won't take you to it won't take you to the specific place. But if but oh. if you're looking for something in specific, and it exists on the sh it has been brought into the ship at some point in time during its existence, it would you would certainly be able to uh, go there to the room in which it is. That is okay. So should you Any ideas, guys? Phil quickly brings into his memory the uh, something that's outside of the room. That's something that's outside of the room. Yeah, yeah, like uh, as in like uh, it, it, outside of the room that is like and that's like the infinite hallway. There's uh -huh. uh, he brings into uh, he he, met, uh, he he remembers the he remembers the look and shape of of like some vase lying around outside the room or something like that. So like. And so, like when and when when we want to leave, Poe can just and Poe can just and Poe can just and Poe can just like grab onto onto like a, one of the. This room has, the... this room has the has the entrance and exit door. That would probably be the, that would probably be the be, the best uh, the best thing to remember this room by. Okay. Cool. Okay. Cool. Sweet. Entrance and exit door. Yes. We can remember that and then walk through a door and just get back. Sweet. Yes. And we have to think of something to go somewhere in the door. Yes, if you're looking for if if you're looking for something in particular that that is contained within the bounds of Moonslip, you will you will be able to find it by walking through the door. What happens if I don't think of anything when I walk through the door? Uh, you'll go to wherever Moonslip thinks you need to be. Now, I'm down. if you will, now if you will pardon me. I am in desperate need of a shower, and he and he walk and he walks through the he walks through the the archway in front in front of you, uh, and begins uh, and and begins uh, begins walking, begins walking uh, confidently striding through se through several archways. You see him walking just straight. And he goes through one set of archways, second set of archways, third set of this archways. He's wa getting farther and farther away. Okay, bye. The rooms are about. All right. the, the rooms are 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 are, are ovoid in sh in shape, uh, and they and they are and they are they're connected at the uh, at at the middle on the long dimension and the middle on the narrow dimension as well. There are there are are pa portals or are apertures. You can also see that there that there are windows that go out and between and between the between these kind of long house shaped uh reed structures there are gardens of all kinds that, that grow that grow that grow fruits that are that you recognize a couple of them but you also see some that obviously do not belong on uh belong on terra would poke uh, would poke recognize any of these plants uh, uh not all of them no i, I said any I'm terribly sorry. I need to step away for just a moment. Okay. Uh, uh, so my idea for what we might be able to go to if they have anything of the sort is kind of like a wide variety. So hopefully there might be something. So Amanda flies up to the entrance and exit door and uh, the entrance and exit door and thinks of Fey, uh, a ancient Fey artifact. And opens the door. 
Any particular ancient Fey artifact? Let's see. Is it one? Is it one that's been lost or? Um. How Bell is still with? Aquapetra's. I'm kidding. An ancient artifact of the Sealy and Unsealy Court. Okay. The what? Okay. The Sealy, good, and Unsealy, not kind good. of evil, kind of evil, not quite, the uh, Fey Court. Cool, all right. The light side and the dark side, Fey. Yeah, all right. basically. Uh, it, keep, in, keep in mind that it, this has to be something that is on, that is on the ship for it to take for it to take you to for it to take I know, you there is, she's trying to see if there if there is such a sort on the ship. Okay. Uh it, uh, it what it o what it opens up into uh you see the you see that after the uh ap after the cap the captain ha the captain ha has wa has now walked three or four three or four archways past and and you and and you see it looks it looks like the like the uh, like the hall like the hallways bend a little bit and then then straight then straighten back then straighten back around and you don't see the captain anymore. Whoa! Don't trust that. Well, let's see. Ancient Celian Celi Court. If they artifact, let's go. Okay, so you walk forward. You you walk through. You walk through the. Uh, you walk through. You walk through into the into the next into the next room. Uh, Tenuriath and Shakti uh, stay stay behind, and they're and they're wa they're watching you confer conferring with uh, conferring with each other. Uh, you walk in, and the room and the room is a po is appointed exact is appointed exactly like the ones. Like the one, like the one that you had just been in, uh, down to down to even the even the bunks the bunks against the wall, uh, and the uh, and the t and the table the table the the two lines of tables down the middle uh, the floor is still is still the same. Um, and you look, but you turn and look behind you, and you still and you see and you see Shakti and you see Shakti and uh, and Tenuriath back back there back there uh still still watching you very much very much very much like like hi yeah go yeah go ahead sure go ahead go ahead enjoy enjoy we'll see we'll uh we'll you know we'll and, see you later uh you turn you you look up you look up and up and down uh to your left to your left and and your to your left and your right um and the the room is uh the room is, the room is pretty is pretty much empty. Um, there's a, there are there's the uh, there's evidence of a hastily abandoned meal uh, on one of the on one of the tables near you. The heck! You look, you look through to the you look through the to the through the the next couple of archways uh, down in the area in which you. Uh, in which you saw the in which you saw the captain disappear into, uh, and you see that it appears to be that that one of the rooms ahead of you uh, gets darker. What good is that one? Because <laughs> so, that's the responsible thing to do. So Amanda, so Amanda, Amanda charges forward. Let's go to that one. Can I stay in the room that I'm currently in and just watch Amanda. Uh, you, That'd be absolutely you stupid. Sure, you sure can. Uh, so, uh, Poke, are you going to go? Are you going to proceed at, forward with uh, with Amanda? Or are you going to stay with Svara? I think he's away from the keyboard right now. Okay, great. So, uh, so Poke's going to stay with going to stay with Svara for right for right now. Uh, as a man, as Amanda charges, as Amanda charges forward into the into the next room. Uh, oh no. Uh, Amanda. Let's see. <laughs> mm -hmm. hey, so guys, you were. 
I'm, I'm really sorry. I'm, I have to go. We have a minor emergency with a tarp on our roof that is oh, in no. the process of coming off. Uh-oh. So, uh, mm. Hope everything yeah. goes okay. Yeah, yeah. Thanks. Be safe. Sorry, guys. Be safe. Sorry. Yep. All right, half our party's gone. <laughs> it's now only the children. The actual children and the one semi-adult. So, uh, to, so Tenurith, Tenurith and, Svar, and Svara are staying are staying back, staying back, watching you. Uh, Poke, Amanda charges charges forward uh, into the into the next room, uh, running towards a running towards a darkened room that you that that they see uh, two more rooms past past that. Do you want to do you or do you want to follow? Do you want to follow uh, Amanda? Do you want to stay with Svara? Do you want to go back to Tenurith? Uh, Poke is going to Poke, follow Amanda. Stay with, uh, uh, stay, with go- stay with me. Stay with me. The echo. It's, it's the good, it's idea. good idea. Poke is going to stay with. Thank you. Poke is going to stay, <laughs> going to stay with Farah. Smart decision. Coward. Coward. So Amanda, you go. T- you go. Tra- you go charging forward. Uh, into the into the next room. Uh, the next the next room has a the next room has a has a sea person at 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 one at one end of it, and you see th- and you see they're at th- they're at the end of this twenty foot long cannon. That it, that the uh, that the end of it that the end of it is the end of it is sticking out where the entrance and exit door would have been. There's what like a, there's a there's a no there's a porthole. <laughs> That the that the end that the end of the cannon is right up is right up next to you, and as you and as you watch, you see them pull the trigger, and the whole cannon goes, whoom, just like pu- pushes pushes itself back about six feet as a huge bolt of energy just goes, whoosh, and explodes. Makes out, sense, normal and cannon. Ex- and explodes out the out the side, uh, of, of out the side of, of the of the ship. No more as, cannon shenanigans. As you watch, as you watch the sea, the sea, per, the sea person pops up, pops open a open a hatch, uh, thro- throws a, throws a, a hat throws a hatch a hatch up. You see one le- one leg. You see one. You, it 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 le- it leans leans its body over sideways. One le- one leg catching the ed- the edge the edge of something, flipping a lo- flipping a large a large uh, crystal cylinder out. That goes clink, 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 clink on the deck, reaches out with two other hands, grabs another one with a glowing amber charge in it, and sho- shoves it, shoves it down as as it as it sit as they sit back down into their seat, pulls the pulls the the breech back down, locks it into place, and begins uh, grabbing the handles again to to aim, again. That's fun. Let's continue on. Uh, cool. So Amanda, so Amanda's Amanda continues forward, uh, past the uh, past the bounds of the bounds of of, of the neck of the next room, um, and is headed o- and is headed over to uh, and is headed over to the f- the following room. Uh, this is a good I'm idea. I'm starting to think that we should accompany Amanda in if she gets into any trouble. Don't you think? This so? is a good idea. Yeah. Uh, Okay. Me and Poke are gonna run after Amanda just to catch up. Yeah. I'm gonna uh, run. Uh, do Do you need to go any faster? Because I can wild shape into something that that's no, a little. No, we're good. We can just we can just we can just run after her. All right, cool. She can't be that fast. So you, you underestimate run... my power. Famous, famous last words. So you run. <laughs> so you run after you run after Amanda and and ca- and catch up catch up with her as she get at. As she gets to the en- the entrance of a dark of a darkened room, oh, a room where the a yeah. room where the where the where the where the light where the ambient light level appears to be uh, appears to be lower than the others, uh, and you feel and and you can and uh, roll me a perception check, Svara. Oh, no, no. All of us are just a net one um, <laughs> on the first roll of the day. That's a great sign. I'll, I'll use my I'll use my other D twenty now. 
Can Poke roll a roll perception check as well? Uh, sure, go ahead. And Amanda, you can as well. Might as well. Might as well. Uh, that is a nat 20. A nat 20. You okay. smell... Hard 20. You, you he, smell something. He thinks he's paladin. He thinks he's paladin. Rolling 20s all over the place. You, you smell... I'm artificial 20. Okay, uh, I'm using the same die as I, as I was using with paladin, so it's not unexpected that I should be... You know, that... Waited, 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 rigged, rigged. I'm kidding. You smell something. You smell something musty. <laughs> musty and musty and uh, and and kind of and almost putrid and a rotten putrid smell. Perfection. That's what we want. Does Poke recognize the smell? Uh, roll me a history check. History check. Yeah. Uh, that's plus two. Uh, that is a 14 plus 2 is 16. 16. Uh, you, you, recogni- you recognize the smell as belonging to some sort of mushroom. But you are, but you are, but it, it's a mushroom that you're like, definitely something spore-like, but I don't remember smelling precisely this before, but it smells like, a, but it smells very similar to a mushroom that only grows in the Feywild. Cooking time! <laughs> so, Amanda, you're going to rush forward into the room? Yeah, it smells delicious. <laughs> uh, so, Poke sticks around in the previous room. And <laughs> we're just, like, watching from afar just in case anything happens, you know? Like, just in case we need to intervene, but if anything bad, like, catastrophic happens... So Amanda runs. Oh, boy, uh, Amanda runs into the room. Swara, uh, you're are you Swara and Poke. You're going. You're going to stay in. Stay in the doorway. So you're going to be make it so that you're going to go it, so that you can see into the room. But you're not yes. going into the room. That. Or are you staying back so you can't see into the room? The uh, we're staying in the store in the doorway so that we can see into the room, but stay out okay. of whatever situation is uh, is occurring. Uh, and in case we need to like go in and save Amanda's buttocks, then we can. Sorry, I can just set everything ablaze. Fine. Uh, so Amanda, as you as you enter into there, uh, roll me you, with your with your artificial twenty uh, check. You see a light drinker mushroom. Ooh. On, on the now, on, ain't that just fun for a light fae? On the on the on the far on the far end, on the far end of the room. It is not just a mushroom, but you can see that the, you can see that there is that it's uh, coming out of the top of a of a large uh, a, a large torus shaped uh, jar uh, that you can see has has micro rhizomes all around the in, all around the inside of it. Uh, and roll me <laughs> roll me a history check, Amanda. Oh, goody. That is a twelve. Uh, she does not care about her history. Uh, Amanda starts coughing. She's like, Bleh. "You're like you, you, you swear that you, you swear you remember something, in <laughs> something from school about 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 uh, about a, a, about an ancient light drinker mushroom, but you can't you but." There's just the haze of so many of so many nights of drinking. You just can't quite think straight. <laughs> you're you're you can't quite remember. God damn it! Amanda was that one kid in college. Yes, I was. I was that one frat kid. Uh, there was uh, not there King was... Henry the si- uh, not not King Henry the seventh, but King Henry the eighth. <laughs> But yeah, you're, but you're but you're you're um al- you're almost you're almost certain that whatever it was, there there was something. There was something dangerous about this. This was something that had to be. Why did it have to be, put away? <laughs> uh, so is Amanda, inhaling the spores. So, so Amanda, are you going to continue to approach the uh, the the mushroom? I'm going to drag Poke in there. So, so you're good. Gonna... Wait, so... I know. We're we're convincing Savara to come in here. You know what? Like, hey, Savara, you want to step in? You want to say hi? 
Absolutely. I I think that this is an opportunity uh, for success. Say hi to Mr. Mushy. Yeah, I'm okay with that. Oh boy. No idea what she's getting herself into. I know exactly what I'm getting myself into. <laughs> but if it asks you a favor, you know what you're getting into. Chaos and destruction and possible death. <laughs> no death. So, uh, you are so you are headed o- you are headed over to uh, to the pe- to the pedestal uh, where this li- where this mushroom is just steadily drinking in light. Oh, what happens if I? I'm gonna cast the cantrip light and just see what happens. Okay. Uh, as you do as you do so, you see that y- you you ca- you ca- you cast you you cast your beam of light into the in, in tor- towards in towards the mushroom and it just seems to just fall it fall into it and doesn't no. doesn't you don't see you don't see a beam of light or anything it just seems to just seems to drink it in huh okay like amanda drinking her liquor we're gonna say stand at like a safe like a safe distance how big is the room uh the room is about uh i would say uh about 50 feet wide by about 200 feet long wow okay yeah i'm gonna say i'm gonna say like a safe like 30 feet away from this thing just in case okay that's a good idea 30 feet away you're about that you're about that you're about that far that far away uh uh and roll me a what's your what's your passive perception Let me look. Twelve. Okay, poke and Amanda. What's your passive perception? Uh, my passive perception is nineteen. Okay. Passive perception wow. is just your it, it, passive perception is just your bonus, right? It's, it's 10, ten plus, plus your bonus. Your bonus. Yeah. Oh, ten plus my bonus, so it's nineteen. Okay. Okay. Uh, so you at so as you're all staying there watching. Uh, as far as as far as feed is sta- is feeding li- feeding light into it, you notice that it almost seems to be growing. And Don't seems- do that again. And uh, and around the entire toroidal uh, shape of it, you see other fruiting bodies beginning to emerge from it. Fun. Let's do that again. I'm gonna stop my light can trip, and I'm just gonna, you know, <laughs> stop that. I'm just gonna stop doing that. Um, for my next trick. <laughs> oh, guys, can you want you want to come in here? You want to investigate this thing? Come on, Poe, come in. Enter. <laughs> Do I sense any more? Do I sense any more? Uh, any more dimensions on this thing? Or is it just still three dimensional? Uh, it is, it is, a, it is actually a, uh, it is actually a three-dimensional creature. Okay. Standard. Um, uh, well, standard is four, but, uh, Oh, right. You know, te- te- most, the, all the, all the other, all the other party, party members, uh, live in four dimensions. Three dimensions of space, one dimension of time. Right. Uh, this is actually a three-dimensional creature. Uh, it appears to it appears to uh, it appears to be timeless. Oh, so it's just like existing. Yeah. Yes. Cool. That's what that's, those do. That's really cool. Can I make another history check? See if I can finally remember it from my drunken haze. No. Yeah. No. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but the fruiting bot the 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 new fruiting bodies that are poking that are sticking up appear to be uh, appear while they while they have slowed down. Now they appear to be the the ends of them appear to be uh, spreading out and getting and getting larger and and squatter and fatter. Let's oh. cause some more light. No, stop. That's that. a good idea. <laughs> stop that! Don't do that. Um, do it. Is there is there any th- way we can like is where is the light source in the room? Uh, the light source in the the light source in the room is uh, is the floor. The floor okay. is bright. Is brightly is brightly glowing amber crystal. Okay, attack the floor. Um, don't. No, don't don't do that. Um, sh- 
Should I cast Eldritch Blast? I know what to do. I'm going to cast Fairy Fire around it. That's a good idea. See how much it sucks up the fire. Uh, no. Oh. Wait. Um, yes? Wait. Um, if it grows my light and you you. set it on fire. Wait, if it's timeless, how does it, like, get hurt? Will it just continue how does it grow? Would it just continue to keep growing? It, it, if it's timeless, how does it even grow? Because it takes time to grow. Yeah. Alright, and I cast, um, Berry Fire around the... around the mushroom. Because I am a stupid human, a stupid fairy who Just likes chaos. Casting Fairy Fire. Okay, so you ca you cast fa you cast fairy fire on it, and uh, and it and it appears and it appears to supercharge its growth. Oh. I they suggest grow, we exit they grow the premises. They grow faster and fa they grow faster and faster, and four of them four of them begin to begin to uh, begin to uh, begin to have eyes open up on them. Oh hi! Hello. Ooh eyes. Hi. As you as, as you as you watch as you watch the, the the four the four of them reach up and 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 uh, and four arms open up on open up on e on each of them, and and they and you hear uh, and you hear a sharp crack and a pop, as uh, oh nice they have little grabbers as they as the as they as they break the fruiting <laughs> bodies off themselves. And, uh, and and four v four vaguely uh, centaurish shapes uh, begin to begin to uh, walk towards you. Go ahead, poke. Oh, Johnny, let's get out. Uh, so, All right, come on. Uh, so DM, does does poke recognize it now? Uh, ro roll a roll a history check, poke. Can I too? Uh, yes, Amanda, because this is now a new form of this. Pretty. Uh, that is a 19 plus 2. 25. Uh, these are, these are, uh, the, these are, uh, this is a mushroom from the negative material plane, uh, also known oh, as the Unseely Court. Uh, it was, a, it, it was actually, it, it it's a, a it's one of the first primordial beings to ever evolve. Um, oh, I have an uncle from there. Uh, and it is uh, and and it it and it it it, exi it exists to drink in energy. Oh, goody! Okay. And now I just made them movable. Yep, and on they, their own. And they are uh, and there are four of them that are stepping forward towards you. All right, Savara. I pick up Savara and I bring her out. No, you don't. Okay. Um, yes, I do. I don't want you to get sucked up into this stuff. You're mm -hmm. a ninth dimensional D. I, I asked them. Do we know if this thing is like hostile? This is highly dangerous, and you do not want to get near it since it is a sucker of all light and energy. So um, I recommend you specifically get away since you are a little ninth dimensional being made of pure light. So get out. Okay, we can we can leave. If but all right, I wanted to I wanted to explore a bit more in this room and but okay, we can leave. I recommend oh. not having you die specifically. Oh, okay, I, so you're... it's one it's one like mushroom thingy. What? How bad it's can it be? Four mushroom thingies that eat light and and it can and make darkness around everything. Uh, yeah, I guess. Or, yeah. The, Yes. So, uh, blight drains energy, right? Uh, blight Indeed. is ne blight is necromantic is a necromantic energy. Uh, yeah, it is, it's a it's a disease. It's a it is a uh, it is yeah. a, it is a uh, it, it is a, a uh, an anti life spell. That's but, basically what it's called. I wonder how this thing is growing if it's not, if it's timeless. Because it takes time to grow, as Antonio said. You know? It's odd. It's weird. Against Super all weird. natural physics, what do you yeah, want? None of my, none of my, none of my spells, like, drain life. Because that's, like, not, that's not my, that's not my dig. That's not, not your my, thing, not you thing. know? Um, yeah, let's leave. 
So are you going to go back the way you came, or are you going to go out one of the other one of the other oh, doors? We're, we're going forward. At least All right, I am. Come, come along if you don't want to die. Fly over here, little boy. Let's explore more. Okay. Says the tiny fairy. All my all my attacks and like spells are like energy based, so you know I can't I can't really I don't really much I can do here. Poke, what do you want to do? Poke is getting the heck out of there because he, they don't they don't want to mess with any no it was it was any it was any primordial being a being that wants to and that wants that wants that wants that wants them for breakfast. No, okay. we just want to feast off of all your energy. It's fine. Uh, Is that what you made of it? Okay, so uh, so uh, who's leading the way into the next into the next room? I am. Um, what are you think, What are you thinking of as as you as you go in there? I'm gonna think of. Nothing. Whoa. I'm just gonna let Moonslip take take, take me take me where I need to go. It puts okay. you in the same room. Oh no! That would be, be really funny. Be... Uh, no. So you so you you walk you walk through, you walk into into the next room and it is and it's empty. Oh. You how so, uh, you however right. uh, you however are at the are at you can tell that because you've you've got you've gotten to where there is no uh there's no door on the other there's no archway on the other side so you're at one end of the ship right now oh okay cool um wait wait that means that the thing can follow us into here hold on hold on, hold on. it's empty right so well i mean it's got it's got the it's got the tables it's got the bunks and everything but instead but instead of there being another archway it's just a long bank of oh. windows along that along that entire uh, along that entire wall. Okay, cool. So we're like us. so we're like normal, right? Um, as as normal as normal can be, right? Yes. You know? Yes. There is still no, but... there, uh, and so that's that's one one long wall that that's facing you is all windows. Uh, to your right, to your right, there is to your right where is the uh, is the porthole to the outside. Um, looks like it looks like there's a spot where a cannon or a weapon or something could be put here, uh, but it but it, there's nothing there at the moment. And then to the left, there's an archway that leads to another to another place in the ship, but that is a closed doorway with a uh, with one of the with one of the the with one of the reed basket like doors pushed into it. All right, Poke, where do you want to go? I want to go home now. <laughs> Besides home, where do you want to go on the ship? Think of something that might be on the ship that isn't what Phone that. Phone home. <laughs> uh, are there any people in here? No, no, there are not. That's Wait, didn't we just? Did you, uh, didn't did were, uh, weren't you just describing a cannon? You're operating a cannon. No. 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 That was a uh, that was uh, two that was two rooms ago. Yeah, but like, uh, oh, in in this room. Oh, oh. Oh, the, I, I thought you meant like on the uh, on this part of the ship. I look out the window. Are we still in space? Yes. It, as a as a matter of fact, not only are you still in space, but the but the planet seems to be seems to be uh, you seem to be much higher above the planet, and you oh, are, no. and you are now and you are now uh, you're now over. The, you can tell that you are over the uh, the far eastern continent. You can see the you can see the the crescent sea, uh, and and uh, and clear and you can clearly see uh, Atlan, the city of all. Uh, oh, cool. Enshrouded it, it with uh, with a uh, with a, with uh, almost almost like a, like it's in the eye of a, of a large bank of clouds. Cool. Very cool. Just take when the cannons open, shoot at them. Are the black rectangles still coming after us? 
Uh, Probably. Th there are only two right now, and as and yeah. as you and as you watch, you see a uh, you see a a blast you see a blast of a of amber energy go shooting past, and hits one of them, and you can see and you see the. You see the the black the black obsidian rectangle just develop cracks as the as the energy pulses over it and just kind of cracks and falls apart, and you can and you can see Svara with your improved vision, you can see individual gnomes on the on the inside gasping as they as they as the air rushes <sighs> out of their lungs and they freeze to death. Oh. But you can see that they're somewhat that they're somewhat still aware because their mechanics. Are still operating. Oh right, that's gruesome. Are there any paths out of this room apart from like an archway, for like like a staircase or something? Uh, there is the there's the basket door that leads you deeper in deeper into the ship. Along as you would, as you're looking at this, this is probably the aft end of the ship. Uh, so you can go closer towards like what would ostensibly be the middle because you're on left, but basically <laughs> at a corner right now. Um, and you could go, uh, you could go, or you can go back the direction that you came. As a matter not of fact, that, not that way. As a matter not of that fact, way. Uh, as a matter of fact, uh, are you all still in the doorway, or are you? Uh... Oh, I'm in the room. Okay. Me so, too. Okay, so, so, all, so all three, so all three of you went in, went in, went into the room. Okay. Uh, as uh, anyone who. Uh, you can all roll a perception check. That is two plus nine, which is eleven. Eighteen. <clears throat> Amanda? Nat twenty. Wow. Second one. That's a lot of Nat twenties. Uh, you you hear you hear a shuffle behind you. You turn around to look, and you see the you see the four mu the four mushroom creatures uh, at the at coming uh, coming towards you at in the doorway. Oh oh no! Can, is there like a, a way we can close it or? Uh, I don't know. Is there? <laughs> you can roll. You can roll me a. You you can roll me an investigation check, a mechanics. Uh, not mechanics. That Star Wars Saga edition. Uh, <laughs> uh, let's see what else is there. Sleight of hand. Uh, sleight of hand is more like uh, is is more like is more like uh, uh, piloting and and uh, oh, yeah. you know, fine motor tasks. Um, how a. About, and this is and this is you're you're looking for you're, you're looking for a closed door button or something like that. Yeah. Um, so let we could say it's an Arcana check, an investigation check. Um, but really, there's no way to open the door, so it's really it would really just be a sham for me to have you roll. Oh, anything. yeah. Um, All right. The ar the archways do not close. Yeah, sure. Um, there's probably a way one of us can, like... Hey, Poke, you have, like, vines or something that you can, like, and, like, you know, close something up, right? Yeah, but here's the thing, though. Those things suck in energy, and it takes energy for vines to grow. Uh, okay, I guess we can just go through the basket door and, like, just avoid the problem at hand. Um, wait a minute. Idea. Yeah. I head to the doorway, thinking of the exit door. That's not a bad idea. The, so you're, the you're, same... you're gonna go through the read door, thinking of the uh, of the exit room. Yes. <clears throat> okay. I will. And I. That's a good idea, Poke. I'm gonna do the same, and I'm gonna drag Amanda on, along with me because it's a good idea, and she's not here right now. So. Okay. So yep. you. So you snap your hands together, capturing Amanda like a like a firefly, and uh, and and uh, po Poke opens the opens the reed door, and the two of you plunge for plunge forward through it, thinking of the egg of the exit room. Whoa. The, Let's go. You pl you plunge the. You plunge through the plunge through the 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 exit. You plunge through the exit door, and find yourself 
back in back in the uh, back in the exit room with uh with the two with the two uh the two sea folk who are sitting on who are sitting in at the one sitting at a table one uh, one on a box at the far at the far end of the room folk says hey. we have an emergency not an emergency it, it's probably nothing you guys it's, it's probably fine just don't worry about it okay we have an emergency if we leave and we let it on the if we let it out on their ship, right? You know, if we leave at some point and it's still on their ship, you know, I'm getting. Aren't you the lawful one? <laughs> these guys, these guys are weird. Like I'm neutral. You're like the lawful one. You should be cut. Uh, you, you should be trying yeah, to. I think it's very lawful and organized that we should just leave it be. No need to generate any chaos. The thing, though, is that out of thing sight, is going out to of cause mind. chaos. And if out we get rid of it sooner or later, out of it sight, will be out of mind. <laughs> so poker, right. poker places the bat, the basket door, the basket door behind behind you, uh, and as the as the as the two sea folk look look up at you and go. <laughs> And go back and go back to their uh, to their to their uh, pads. What are you looking at, Kenny? Uh, so, uh, so uh, I don't I don't don't mind if it, if there's like a if, if like a couple of uh, lights uh, light sucking centaurs walk out uh, walk out of that door. Just uh, keep on with your business. And then <laughs> and, and then poke and then poke promptly flies through the exit door. You know what? Yeah, actually, no, I will let them know just in case. You never know, right? You're right. Um, Poke's yeah, gonna fly um, out the exit door in space. Oh, <laughs> as in like exit of this area of the ship. Okay, and, so like, which which, dire which direction do you which direction do you want to go? You've got the uh, you have the archway where uh, where Tenuriath and Shakti are are stand are standing in their their heads their their heads are together and they're having some so some sort of some sort of argument. They're like, just no, just no, just no. Why don't you cook it this way? No, you cook it this way. You gotta put in the milk first and the cereal second. No, you put the cereal first and the cereal second. And I'm just like, <laughs> the cereal first and then the cereal second. <laughs> you okay, Amanda? Bull first. Bull first. <laughs> oh wow. Okay. You all right? <laughs> She just put the bowl first. She swallowed some of the spores from the. She, she, yes. she, she swallowed. She swallowed the cereal without without the without the milk. She forgot the bowl. <laughs> just poured the entire box like. Just on the table. <laughs> it's dry. <laughs> and I was like, "What milk?" You know, it's like. <laughs> you don't eat milk. You don't eat cereal. <laughs> exactly, you don't eat milk. <laughs> you don't eat cereal. That's the milk. Yeah, you do. It doesn't us. get soggy. Oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm fine. Continue. I'm surrounded by idiots. I'm kidding. <laughs> you, are, you, you are, maybe. Uh, so... So you're back. So you're back in the you're back in the entrance room. The two sea people are are in there. There's no evidence of the captain, um, and Tenuriath and Shakti are sta are standing in the archway having some sort of argument. Uh, I walk over to the two. What's up? What's what's going on? They, they, they look over at you. They look. Shakti looks over at you and and, and says, "And you stay out of it." And. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. And you stay out of it. I I will. So she was expecting B Savar to come along and be like, so no, what's your no, that's do? not that's not that's not something that. You know what? I think I will stay out of it. I'm just gonna like walk past them and like with shock tea, I'm gonna do the thing where they. When when someone walks like through, mm -hmm. yeah, I'm gonna like like put 
like do the shoulder bump thing as I walk past them, just like you know what? I will stay out of this. <laughs> uh, roll a roll an athletics check. <laughs> Athlet, athletics or, or acrobatics, either of the two. Um, it accidentally makes a dent in your own armor, just bumping it. Athletics. I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm doing athletics. Okay. Uh, sixteen. Uh, so you go, so you go to, you go to bu- bump into her shoulder, and it's like, and and it's like bumping into a mountain. Oh, like she. And she's and you hit her and she just and you you smack into her and she looks at her at her shoulder, looks up at you like, are you okay? Did you hurt yourself? Did I did I hurt myself? Did I take any damage? No, you 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 didn't. But I mean, but literally, she's immovable. When an unstoppable yeah. force meets an immovable object, <laughs> like um, li- literally, she's I an mean, unmovable rod. Yeah, I, I'm like, oh yeah, sorry, sorry about that. I'm, I'm just good. Uh, are, are you all right? Yeah. Oh yeah, I'm fine. Very well. So we're in the middle of a deep discussion here. So, you, is everything okay? Uh, like it seems like a heated argument. It will be fine if you are not here. It was which came first, the chicken or the egg? Um. <laughs> she tur- yeah, okay. She turns. Sure. Gra- she turns. Grabs Tenurius <laughs> by. Tenurius. Grabs Tenurius by the ear. And begin and begins wa- and begins walking away walking away from you into the next into kind the next like a, room. That's kind of like a weird I'm dynamic. It's like, it's like it's like Shakti is the mother of Tenurieth. When Tenurieth is the actual mom. <laughs> and Tenurieth's yeah. like ah. Yeah. Ow 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 ow. Um. <laughs> is so there's no there's no captain there's no like big is there anything of interest anything that's like glowing or something uh roll me an any investigation rooms check. is there any absence of light or energy in the, the general area that amanda can go to to cause We've more havoc got, uh an 18 well you can look in you can look the other th- through the other set of arches sure why not i'm, I'm down you guys coming Sure. You look through the other set of archways, and and again you see just a series of archways extending down as far as you can see. There's a multiplicity of ro- of, of rooms here. Um, uh, with your, uh, are you looking for anything? Looking for anything in particular, or? They both raise their hands. Um, you can just speak. No, you don't no, have to raise your hand. Ah, so the, the so the, the, uh, so uh, Poke is going to think of uh, the Poke is going to think of uh, a druid scroll. A, a druid scroll. Any, so you said a druid scroll. Any particular druid scroll? Uh, yeah, one detailing the process of of uh, of, of uh, what what is it? I uh, of uh, absorbing energy. Absorbing energy. Yeah. A druid spell to absorb energy. A necromancer spell. I think you want. Okay. Uh, you as you as you look as you're looking do, as you're looking down the down the hallway, uh, you look away real quick and look back and you something's changed. Something. Like something just oh, yeah. different. Like yeah, it's, it's, some, something, something has something has changed, but you're not exactly sure what. Oh no. Spara is going to look into the first arch. Just like peer in. Uh, you look Can in. Anyone look at the one opposite. <laughs> you look in, and it is, and it, the room is. The room is a little. The room is. Uh, the room. Is, the room is a uh, a greenhouse, of some kind. Oh. At, you you step oh, into the archway plant, and look around, and, <laughs> and it is and it and it has it has changed into into a greenhouse, uh, and there is a, 
and and there is a uh, th there's a multiple multiplicity of plants. Um, some are potted, some are some are in long planters. Some you can't even see what they're in. Some are hanging, are, some are hanging from the ceiling. Uh, large multiplicity of fruits. Uh, very very. Sorry, how do I make these ones be able to move? Very dense plant population. <laughs> I'm going to walk in because plants are good. We don't oh, want the mushroom always. to find this room. If the mushroom finds this room, it's going to become pop, pop, pop. <laughs> what, what, what? I'm going to level up ten times. So you're going to proceed forward and <laughs> investigate the room? Affirmative. Uh, Affirmative. So Again, it's about it's about uh, it's about fifty feet by uh, fifty feet fifty feet w uh, w long in front of you between fifty feet between the uh, between the archway to so the next this between the archway between rooms and then about a hundred feet in uh, in either direction to the left and right. To your left is the e is still the edge of the ship. Uh, to to your right to your right is uh, another one of the another one of the basket. Uh, one of the basket doors. Uh, it, the room is the room is entirely occupied by uh, by foliage and plants of all sorts of, of type, medicinal value, uh, biome that they come from. Um, it looks like just specimens, just a big collected room of specimens. <clears throat> hey, poke. What you what you think about again? I thought of uh, uh... I, I thought of a, of a druid scroll to absorb energy. No such thing. Do I see anything like that in here, or does there's nothing like that, right? Uh, this room is this as far as you can see in here. This room is just chock full of life signatures. Uh, each one, each one is a separately glowing soul. So your uh, your multi dimensional sight here is it's kind of like. <clears throat> It's kind of like being a being an, a, a radio astronomer looking into a field of pulsars. Hmm. <laughs> wow. So, uh, yeah, that's like the complete opposite of what you asked for, Poke. Okay. Uh, kind of weird. Poke walks. Well, it must have been that uh, that no such thing exists on the ship. Um. Poke walks into the next room, thinking of. I think. I think of. I. I of a book to uh, to uh, uh, take care of uh, 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 to take care of uh, as in like a, a like a destroy one of those like life suck uh, uh, air, air light sucking mushrooms. A book <laughs> to destroy one of the light sucking mushrooms. <laughs> yeah, like so, some way to uh, some way to get rid of the, get rid of the issue that uh, that's on that's on the ship. Because those things aren't natural. They are technically. Uh, so you look. So you look. You hop. O you hop over. T over to the archway, and uh, and you're looking at and you're looking at Svara's back uh, disappearing into the can into the canopy ahead of you. And Svar Svara Svara walks through walks through the next bunch of plants and comes up behind you and says, "Okay, what's in the next room?" It's you. What? Oh wait, that's not wait, that's not me though. It is well, you, you Svara, you break you break through you break through the canopy yeah. and there's Poke oh, okay. standing at standing at the archway, looking at looking looking into the looking into the next room. And what what's in the next room? He said, "Me." Yeah. The archway, I... that you're, the archway that you're that that you're that you're now looking through. It looks like you're looking at the same room again, on the other side of the archway. Okay. The Grinch style, like, "Hello, how are you?" I asked you first. I asked you first. Oh, that's on some nerve saying exactly what I'm saying. Hey, hey, hey. Wait, I'm an idiot. You're an idiot. Yeah. All right. Okay. So, um, 
I guess I go into the next room. So, uh, so Svara, wa Svara walks walks into the, into the next room, and it, it's like you're standing right where you were just where you were just standing a minute ago. This is some this is some weird, weird 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 stuff. It looks like everything everything's even in the exact same place. And as you're looking, it's like yeah, there's the silver thorn bush that was right there, and here's the spider plant, and there's the aetheless plant. So you know, everything's exactly and as it was. Definitely night shade. Yeah, everything. Okay, I guess I'll tr open the door to the next one. So you're gonna sort of loop. You're gonna go. You're gonna go to the right and open the basket door. Or are you going to go go through the foliage, the same way you just did to get back? The to same front? way I just did. Okay, so you begin push. You begin pushing mm. through the foliage, and you and you emerge walking away from Poke. You push. The, you push the Poke. You watch. You watch. You watch Svara as they as they disappear into the foliage, and a couple seconds later, you hear a rustling behind you, and you hear Svara again. What? Uh, Pope goes to the door that uh, that uh, that uh, Svara just walked out of. Okay, that. Hmm. <laughs> Svara didn't just walk through a door. Svara walked through, went through an archway, disappeared into some foliage, and then came out of the foliage behind you. That is. So I, so I walk in the direction that Svara just came from. Okay, All right, what are you cuckoos doing? So, Amanda Poke, flies in. So, Amanda, you're going to go through the foliage as well? Amanda was never in the foliage. Okay, so Amanda is still, still at the original archway looking looking into the room then. Is that what right? What are those cuckoo heads doing? Well, then you saw, you saw, them, hmm. you saw them disappear into the foliage. In the room, I yell at them just like, "Yo, what are you doing?" Uh, you get, can both roll a perception check, if you wish. But it's going to it, you're going to have to roll a nat twenty to hear her. That was not one. <laughs> yeah, I didn't. I didn't roll a nat twenty. Okay, so neither of you, neither of you can hear Amanda. Disturbing uh, again. So poke you. All right, you go, time to set this thing in place. You no. just you disappear. <laughs> you disappear through the through the foliage again, and uh, and you you push your way th you push your way through the trees and you uh, through the through the bushes and stuff, and you emerge on the other side, and there's Svara's back looking looking at a wall of foliage. Whoa. <sighs> Svara, you hear the rustling in the foliage behind you, and you see Poke come hopping out. Um. Yeah, that's um, that's some that's some weird weird stuff. Wait, does Amanda have the scrying globe that can contact uh Poke or Savara? I don't have a scrying globe. Poke uh, doesn't have a cell phone. And I, and Amanda doesn't have a scrying globe either. I don't think. <laughs> Of course, all of us have something so useful right now. <laughs> None of us have it. I wonder what happens if... Okay, mm -hmm. I'm going to walk into the foliage, and instead of walking forward into the foliage, I'm going to, like, go a different direction in the foliage, you know? Just so, so, like, are turn you, are right. You, are, you going to, are you going to go... Uh, are you going to turn right towards the edge of the ship, or are you going to turn left towards the in interior of the ship? Um, left. Okay, so you turn you turn left and you begin you begin pushing your way through, uh, and shortly and ap and after and after a, a at, and after about maybe twenty thirty feet of of just pushing through pushing through various plants, none of which belong in the same biome together. Yeah. Uh, you you push through in, into this in, into this kind of like an atrium area, uh, which is which is which is a, a room just completely faced all the way around with plants uh Whoa. the room the room gl the room glows for glows from the floor from the amber crystal of the floor and there is a uh and and you see a, and you see a you, you see a uh you see three bush three bushes arrayed in, arrayed in in a triangle in the in the middle of the space uh they're uh they're 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 uh they, they're kind. They're kind. They're long. They're long leaves, kind of like, uh, kind of like sawgrass. 
and uh, and they're just and the three of them are just kind of standing there, uh, wait their their fronds uh, standing sticking up and waving slightly, in a in a, in what appears to be an artificial breeze of some co- of some sort. Oh, cool. Interesting. Okay, so it's different. This is a room I have not seen before. You have not seen this place. Before. I haven't seen this. Okay. Mm. Interesting. Okay. All right. But, it, but it, it's it's kind of like a, a little hollow inside a large volume of foliage, and the foliage mm. is completely variegated, and you can tell that it's from all different kinds of plants. And like I can see where I came from, right? Uh, you well, where you push through, yes. It's yeah. kind of like it's kind of like going through going through extremely dense forest, where you can where and you come into a hollow. Just how big is Moonslip? Holy, there's so much. Um, is there any like bigger on the door? inside? Is there any basket door like like there are where in the other? You haven't gotten there no? yet, but you okay. also but you also have not, you also only went like forty feet, True. and you know and you know and you know the room would be a hundred feet long. Yeah. Um. So it's a little hollow. I'm gonna walk to these bushes that are swaying in the artificial wind. Okay. Uh, one of them sa- speaks to you in Sylvan and and, and says, what? <laughs> and, and, and yeah. says, and says hello. Oh gosh, with a bag of meow. What's your name? My yeah, name is. Sh- nice to meet what a you. Name. Sh- 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 That's a memorable name. One of the other one of the other ones says to, says to you. And what are you called? My name Anyone. is... Well, I don't know if you'd be able to pronounce it, but my name, my mortal name is Svara. What, the, the, third one sa- the third one says, <laughs> Welcome, Svara. Share our water if you wish. Where's your water? There is a there is a uh, a fourth uh, a fourth planter that is vacant. A planter? Yes. Oh, oh. like it's a pot. Yes. Don't touch it. Don't I don't know touch if I want to do this one. <laughs> what? Why would I want to share your water? If you are thirsty. I I don't. I'm not we thirsty sh- at the moment. We share with all. <laughs> Do I have to stay for a while? You stay as you wish. Okay. I don't trust that language. We sit. We simply. We simply abide. Oh. Cool. Um, I'm just gonna. You know what? How bad could it possibly be? Right. No! Um, how bad could that possibly be? Let's sing. Yeah. How? No. How bad could it possibly be? We are going. Well, we're we're gonna we're gonna play this safe. Um, let's look. Um, do I? There's no like magic around. Like there's no there's no magic, right? This entire yeah. ship is magic. Oh. Okay. Well, but you are this, in, you, you are, in, you are inside a, a magic ship. Is there like a concentration of magic here? Or, you're inside a ship that is bigger <clears throat> on the inside than the outside. Fair, fair enough. Um, the water that the, the what water that they're in the the planters that they're in are magical, but the water appear the water in that you see in the planter there appears normal for a for a swamp for a swamp dwelling plant. Okay. Um, I'm just gonna go to that pot and I'm just gonna reach down no I'm going to reach down with something like a spoon I don't have a spoon on me um I don't know a part part of my (laughs) I'm just gonna I'm just gonna gonna scoop it with my hand and just like okay uh, so you sample the like water. A barbarian. Roll me a Constitution save, please. Sweet, I knew oh, that. One. I knew that was coming. I knew that was coming. I knew that was gonna happen. 
That's why you don't take the water for the place where I just like, come take a drink. I knew, I, knew, I knew this was gonna happen. Uh, 17. You gain six temporary hit points. Oh. Oh! You are, Sweet. you are, you are <laughs> healed. <laughs> you are healed and rejuvenated. The, uh, the... To maximum health? Uh, if you aren't at maximum health, you go, you go to maximum health. Nice! Oh! How uh, bad could it possibly be? Uh, the, 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 it is, it is 100% swamp water. Um, but, oh, uh, but it, but it's, Delicious. but, you know, but, but most swamp water is actually full of all sorts of nutrients and good stuff. So, uh, because you have an angelic constitution, uh, you <clears> have, <throat> you don't have, you don't have any, you don't have any problem with, uh, any of the microbes and stuff that live with it because that's life as well. Oh, that's awesome. Easy. Thanks a lot. So tell, so tell us, why are you here? <laughs> You're muted suddenly. Oh, oh, sorry. I, I, I didn't. You weren't my, pushing my to push talk. Wasn't on. Yeah, I wasn't pushing to talk. Um, I'm here because we were running from these... Uh, do you know what a gnome is? Gnome. No. Okay, so we were we were running from these uh people, and they were just, and uh, they were trying to do bad things, and we ended up here. So. Bad things. <laughs> you speak so <laughs> fast. You are all so hasty. Hasty? We're trying to save the world here, so we should probably be hasty with a lot of things. The, sec the second one sa the second one says saving the world. So much to so much to do. So busy. The world will the world will survive. Will it? One way or another, the world will sur the the world will continue. Good point. All things grow and die in time, except for gods. Well, I mean, well, some gods die, I guess. Um, well, it was nice meeting you guys, uh, but I gotta get back to my group, and uh, yeah. Uh, so, uh, we'll, we'll return to you in a second. Uh, yes. Poke and Amanda. Uh, so, Swa so Svara takes a, takes a, mm. uh, takes a hard left mm. turn and disappears into the foliage. Um, so, uh, Poke, uh, Poke tries to, uh, uh, Poke tries, uh, Poke tries to follow them. Okay. Okay. So, Amanda, poke this. Poke turns and turns and and, uh, and disappears into the foliage behind Svara. What do you do? Again, I'm not with the fol in the foliage. Um, I'm going to walk through the doorway, thinking of where in the world is Svara. Uh, okay. Okay. Well, I mean... So, so you so you you go you go through you go through the doorway and uh, and you you put and. Uh, you you find yourself at the same foliage wall that, that you were just standing at. Oh. Okay. All right. Uh... So is this what the do what we're doing? Um, I'm going to go right. You're gonna go right. Savara went left. Right. She, Amanda doesn't know which direction Savara went. Okay. She wasn't in the foliage. Okay. So, uh, <laughs> so Amanda, so Amanda, go, Amanda goes right and put and put pushes through several of the plants, uh, plants which you all which you all recog which, which you recognize pretty much all of them, um, because at some point or another the Fey realms touch uh, a good chunk of a good 
several of the worlds <laughs> and you are able to uh and you so several of these plants are known to you uh several of them are not um and uh and you you push you 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 push your way through and uh and you and you find your and you find yourself uh you find your you push through and you find yourself uh, after about 60 feet uh you find yourself in a in a small in a small glen mm -hmm. uh that is ma that is that is uh that is is made is covered in uh in woody stems it's like you're it's like you're standing in a in a small in a small maybe maybe 10 foot maybe 10 foot uh, area that is completely walled in by uh by uh bamboo like stems big green thick stems that uh that 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 are that are very tall and that are very actually the leaves are kind of sharp and it is a what do i it, see it's a it's a little it's a little it's a little closed area um uh sitting sitting in sitting inside cross le cross legged uh is a is is a uh it, it appears mm -hmm. to it appears to be almost like almost like a tumbleweed but uh but it but it but it it's but it's sitting there in the center in the center of of this kind of swept bare dirt floor uh with a with a with a small uh, a small uh campfire with a with a with a small metal teapot on it and a couple of uh and a and a low table with a couple of uh with a couple of, of uh teacups on it uh you can see that the tumbleweed is indeed alive and is a type of plant person how do you do sir it looks at, it looks up at you it looks up at you and 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 mm -hmm. and Russell's I wait and abide. How do you, Fae? How do you, Fae Queen? Um, um, I, uh, I wasn't expecting that answer. Um, <laughs> I was not going to address me as Fae Queen. Oh, you appear to be Fae Queen. I apologize if if I am mistaken. Oh no, it's just I haven't last in my check. I haven't inherited the title of queen yet. Royalty, yeah, I guess. Queen, not yet. Hmm. <laughs> well, soon I am sure. Hmm. Thank. You. I guess I'm doing fine. I'm not able to check in with the uh, multidimensional and other universe mandos because my flower is not allowed to work in this subspace. Separation is in is indeed traumatic, but you can always go home again. You are not planted in one place. That makes me planted. If needed, one can always return to their roots. <laughs> but um, shush. That wasn't that was our character. Yep. Uh, so uh, back to back to poke. Poke, you go. You you struggle. You struggle through through the through the foliage for a, for a few for a few minutes. Uh, Svara, right as you right as you are uh, right as you are are getting ready to leave, Poke bursts bursts through the foliage and finds you. Oh, hi, Poke. Hello there. <laughs> no, you are oh, stop! The bold stop one. it. Okay. We, we don't want to be sued by we don't want to be sued by by that uh that that rodent that <laughs> that that one rodent in particular. The the three the three sets the three sets of swamp grass immediate immediately begin shh at poke at at poke's entrance and they and 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 they say and and they say they they say 
The Blackbird, the Blackbird has come! The Blackbird has come! Felicitations, Blackbird! Who's, who's the Blackbird? The Blackbird behind you! They have, they, he, he has come! He has come! To Felicitations! The poll time of pollination has has arrived. <laughs> when the blackbirds come, the time of pollination has arrived. <laughs> what, what, what are you gonna pollinate, Paladin? Poke, 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 poke. What are you gonna pollinate, poke? Uh, well, I've been. I have done, like, the artificial pollination between plants before, but, like, uh, I, I haven't done it between, like, speaking plants. <laughs> I, I don't know, like, I, I've never cast speaking plants while they, while they were in the middle of, um, the, the, the thing. Come, come, Black, come, Blackbird. Drink for... <laughs> Drink, drink, for, drink with us, uh, drink with us, and be and be healed, that you may, that you may pollinate, that you may pollinate our, uh, uh, and continue our existence. What are you doing? I, I drank from the swamp water, and it was actually, it was actually, it's actually kind of fire. I'm not gonna lie. You also fire. can't get sick, dude. I, I get, He's I mortal. Get, I can get sick. No, you I'm, can. With like angelic diseases. Like I, I'm, I'm still, I'm just a bird. Aren't you a druid? Aren't you like super into nature? Mm. I'm, I'm super into nature, but, but some nature isn't super into me. <laughs> oh, come on, dude. You're, you're, you'll be fine. Just go drink up. Like the, those guys are really cool. Uh, I'm not gonna take the peer pressure. I shouldn't take the peer pressure. Take the peer pressure. <laughs> <laughs> Take it. Take it, Blackbird. They if need you, if you, you could, to. If, if you couldn't tell, Paladin, I'm currently peer pressuring you. Poke. It's not Paladin. It's not very angelic of you. Poke. <clears throat> Poke. I'm currently peer pressuring you into doing this thing that you should probably do anyway. Yeah. Just take a sip of the uh, of the Kool Aid. It's not poisoned. <laughs> take a little quick sip. Just like a little. Um, no, just a quick little. Uh... And I got a bunch of healing spells. If something goes wrong, just like just. All right. Um. Where were we? Pope's gonna drink the. Uh, Pope's gonna drink the. Uh, drink. Uh, drink. I drink the. Uh, drink the, uh, the swamp water. Hopefully the plants aren't too, uh, into it. So Poke hop, Poke takes a couple hops over to the planter and beats his wings a, a little bit to to fly up to the side, with the with with a quick with a quick rock, and and <laughs> looks 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 consi considering the considering the water a little bit looks up looks up at Svar as far as like, and the plants are all like, and Poke's like. Roll me a constitution save, Poke. There it is. No, oh, no. He thinks he's going to be in trouble now. Oh, he's going to become oh, drunk with the hippie. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Another roll. I rolled another nat 20. <laughs> a seven. Wah, wah. You get... You gain two temp... You Are you at max hit points? Mmm... <laughs> Any any persistent conditions are cured, and you gain two and you gain two uh, two temporary hit points. Oh, well then. And then he it falls into the fine. pot. Then he falls into the pot. I mean, into the water. Uh. So. Oh, whoa, whoa, my God, that's a a screen. <laughs> That you have going on there. Oh, what was that? Oh god, you, you got your screen is um freaking out, big hell. My screen is. Yeah, it's um, really? a lot of rectangles and squares. For you. I, I don't see it. Oh really? Oh, no, I think you need to exit 
it out yeah, and I then got it. I got come it. back in. Okay. Welcome back. Yeah. Um. Is it still doing it? No, no. It, you, your screen just went. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Be interested to see that. Uh. So. Um, yeah. So, um, so Amanda, you are, you're, you're, you're standing there. You're standing there with the, uh, with the, with the tumbleweed person. Did I go back to my home? They finally accept the throne. Finally, grow as a person and learn how to treat others with actual respect. <laughs> Amanda starts slowly freaking out. It's like, what have I been doing all my life? Having an ex, Amanda was having an existential crisis. Okay. Uh, well, the back, to Svara and Pope. back to Swara like and Pope. Back to Swara and Pope. I'd like to see an alignment change in Amanda, turning her no. like, really good and like really like posh and British, and that'd be really really funny. She ain't been no British. Ew, swamp water. You expect <laughs> me to drink swamp water? He's drinking swamp water. What would be funny is if, like it is like. Everyone else's reaction to this as well. Like a couple sessions ago, a couple sessions ago, they, and, they, and, 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 and Amanda was all like, it was all like, hell yeah, and, and, and all like, on board. And, and, and then now she's all like, and she's all like, and she's all like, part of me. Part of me is empty. Not no swamp water. How dare they? She really brought the queen and the fake queen. <laughs> And so, so, uh, <laughs> so Swara and Swara and Poke, you are you're you you're each, you're each feeling pretty good there on either side on either side mm -hmm. of the fourth planter, uh, with Very your mellow. with your three uh with your three sawgrass companions there. Yeah, trying to vibe, yo. They, they and they 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 say, they say blackbird. Are you here to carry our seeds? Um, I I can. I've I've got a I've got a bag. <laughs> <laughs> I think you need a little bit more of that swamp water, boy. I brought my pencil. <laughs> That's the best response ever. Can you carry our seeds? I got a bag, like. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, so they 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 say, please, 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 black blackbird. It has been so long since we since since we have been in our natural habitat. Uh, if if you could take our seeds and spread the and spread them to new and fertile lands, you would you would ensure the survival of our clan. Do I recognize these plants and know where they live? Naturally. Uh, roll me a. What kind of check should these this? Plants be? Are, these plants are high on life right now. Uh, nature, let's... nature check. Yes, definitely a nature check. All right, so that's a plus two. Uh, and that is an eight. An eight. Womp, womp. Uh, they <laughs> look like they look like swamp grasses of some kind, but you don't recall ever seeing swamp grasses of this. You coloration. need to find the plant expert, eh? I think I'm supposed to be the this, plant expert. This um, is the, these these are not these are not from any from any uh, from any planet or place that you have ever been to. You rec you recognize you know similar plants mm -hmm. and. You know they have root structures that are, they're make them obviously swamp plants, and you know the way their the way their their leaves are obviously they're they're uh, tropical to temperate, and you recognize properties of them, but you do not recognize them specifically. Hmm. May I ask where where do you guys live? We come from uh, we we come from it we come from the southern Moonshay Isles on Toro. Land down under. On on the Moonshade Isles on Toril. Yes, we we uh, we uh, we guard the we guard the moon wells for the druids. Oh. Okay, uh, I'll up here to right here. here. In, in cross reference to that. Uh, mm -hmm. So yeah, I'll, 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 I've got I've got a bag here. Just uh, put put your seeds in there. <laughs> 
I'll, I'll make sure to put. Uh, I'll... Very, very well, and they and they just go. So you collect the seeds. <laughs> you collect the seeds. Uh, you are now a, so you you may now you may now uh, say uh, you may now uh, include in your inventory a bag of uh, a bag of of a uh, sawgrass sawgrass plant per, sawgrass plinth seeds. You are now in possession of. Seed. <laughs> <laughs> Mystery plant. Dee, 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 dee. Oh yeah, this the Zelda. Where's my inventory? Ah, there it is. Uh, so, uh, so, uh, plant sawgrass. Yes, yeah, sawgrass plant seeds. Let me find that. Amanda, roll me a perception check. Oh no. All right, let's see. Fourteen. You hear you hear a series of loud thuds getting uh, that are approaching your position. Oh no! Zoom. Oh crap! Zoom. Oh no! Oh Zoom. no! Zoom! Zoom! I am. Oh crap! Oh no! Oh gosh! Why me? Oh no! This is my fault. Now I should have taken responsibility and figured out a way to kill this thing beforehand. I fly. I start flying up, and I'm just like, "Hey, you want to go for a ride, Mr. Tumbleweed? That's great." I pick him up and I put him on my shoulders. So uh, how many? How many saw? How many sawgrass seeds are there? Six. Six. Okay. Uh, so you pick up the tu the tumbleweed guy, and and he's like, "Oh." Oh, oh, thank you very much. Oh, hey, uh, what, what, what are you doing? I, I, oh, oh, this is quite irregular. Oh, oh. So you pick him up and you do, and you retreat out of the back, out, back through the foliage. No, I fly up. I fly. So you begin, oh, you begin flying, flying directly up towards the ceiling, which is about twenty-five feet overhead, which is where the, which is where the, the reeds are woven together. Uh, and as as you begin flying up, you see that the 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 kind of bamboo grassish walls begin waving, and you see they part in one spot, and a huge minotaur head comes comes po comes poking in. It's like it's like Ooh. it's like where are you? Where are you? And hu and with with hu with huge ho huge horns and a long and, and a long and a long slout snout. Poking, poking in, look, poking in, looking, looking around. Uh, it, oh, crap. It, do, oh, crap. It, it doesn't, it doesn't seem to see you. Yet. Go invisible now. What is it? Crap, 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 crap! I need to find my spell. Get dang it! This is got to be my action. Wait, is it like a, another evolution of those of like those centaur thingies? No. Or is it just no? Just no. Is, this so is a this is a giant minotaur head. Okay, oh. okay. I can I can pass without a trace. I can pass without a trace with the tumbleweed guy. Okay. So you pa so you pass you pass without trace, and mm -hmm. uh, I imagine you're going to disappear into the foliage, heading yeah. back head, heading in the direction of the other two. I'm going left this time. Okay, so you, so you, so you, you pass, you pass quickly, quickly through the foliage. Uh, so about, so about the, about this, about this time, uh, Pal, uh, uh, Poke and Svara, uh, Amanda, Amanda comes, comes, pelting out of the, out of the foliage towards you, carrying this, carrying this tum, this pl tumbleweed plant on, on, on their back. Sorry about that, dude. I thought it was some other uh, dangerous creature. Sorry about that. But I'm here. Uh, we are and, screwed. 
Oh, uh, no, sorry, go ahead, Amanda. I tell the two of them that I'm guessing are probably drunk by now from the swamp water. There's a huge, and like as low, but as, as tolerable I can, where I'm just it's like, there's a huge monitor guy, and I don't know who he's looking for, but it might be me. It probably is me because I do some crazy freaking crap all the time. Ooh. But the Minotaur, and we like No, we don't want to see it. He seems mad, and he seems sorry he's out for blood. Okay, okay. So, anyways, we'll just we are take probably his blood from him. Ten... We seem to like we're screwed over ten times, okay? So, I've already went through one existential crisis today. I do not need another. Okay? Okay, great. Let's do this. Let's get out of here. The, thir the three pla the three pla plants begin 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 wa begin waving waving a little faster and they say and they say they say grandfather it's been so long since you've come to visit us it's so good to see you and the and the the and the the and the and the, the tumble the tumbleweed hops down off your shoulders and climbs up onto the planter and stick and, <laughs> and reaches down into it and immediately begins begins growing long bladed leaves that uh, and begins to uh, and begins to wave with all the others, and the four of them say, oh. "We are now complete. We are now complete, uh, it's grandfa <laughs> grandfather. It's been it's been so long since we've been together." And they all begin reaching out tendrils to each other and begin creating Whoa. a creating a, li a little circle circular bush, Aww. a little a little circular thicket together. That, uh, that you can feel a gathering magic now that now that uh, their circle is connected. A bad gathering magic or a good one? A gathering good one. Magic? Or just gathering magic? Maybe gathering one magic. Can go ahead. To... Okay. Just... Th there's, uh, th th does Book just so happen to, um, I don't know, recognize this magic? Uh, roll me a nature check. Okay. Uh, that is nineteen plus two. Nineteen oh, nice. plus two. Uh, you've 21. read that, you've read that uh, that in that many of the ancient druid henges around the uh, around the di the different worlds, some of them were grown were grown by stone plants. That they, that you pl you plant them you plant them in a circle with however many posts you want. Once they all connect to each other, they. Uh, they will reach out and they will grow and create a a druid circle, suitable for transport, suitable for transportation uh, across the universe. Is Let's there, go. Uh, is there well, other things that this druid circle are used for? Oh yeah, a wide variety of. As a matter of fact, there is one of those druid circles on Oceanus's Forge where you just left, about a six thousand about a six thousand eight hundred year old one. Oh. Hold Wait, on. Should Amanda also know this since she's a pure druid? Did Amanda go above ground at Oceanus's Forge at all? Because you were in. No. She, every time you no, guys. No, no, no. I'm not talking about the Oceanus Forge zone. I'm talking about like the little druid circles thingies. Uh, well, I mean, you would, you would, you might. You didn't ask to, on... you, you didn't ask to roll, so. Yeah. So, sure. would the, uh, so, uh, what what poke once this druid circle is complete be able to use this druid circle to teleport to the next druid circle? Uh, potentially, but you're not sure how it would work given the fact that you're in an extra dimensional space right now, or at least a stretching of space. Wait, can I roll to see if I know how to figure it out? Uh, sure. If you want to roll a nature check. Sure. Why not? I have a plus six. It's fine. All right, let's see. And we got a twelve. <laughs> I'm like, oh, I plus six. That's fine. Twelve. Uh, you can see that they're. You can see that they are. Uh, that they're. Re they've reached runners out to each other, and their vines are entwining. And there's some sort of gathering magic between the plants. Amanda's drunkenness and her and her stresses make it so she can't remember nothing. <laughs> I can't remember if you plants make tea or if you <laughs> are the tea. So, uh, uh, 
uh, Svara, both the, both the two of them have made uh, have made checks. So, uh, are you trying to gather any information? They seem to have it all figured out. Okay. This is by the Neo. Uh, yes. Go ahead, Poke. Can I ask the plants what they are doing? Uh, the plants say, "We are ce we are celebrating and growing together with our grandfather, who we have not seen in a long time." Okay. Should I be outside of the circle when you guys are doing this? Come grow with us. I no. highly advise against that, Poke. You, yeah, out of there. Stay I, right uh, here. Uh, I I asked the two others. Uh, come come on. Uh, let, let's move. Let's let's move out of the way. We're already out of the way. You're the only one inside. Really? Yeah. Oh no. Oh. So the rest. Oh, no. So so the rest of you. So you're all, you're all withdrawing. Are you, are you going Amanda, toward? Just, Amanda, where'd you say that Minotaur was? Um. Let's go that way. From? No. Man, it's like. Heck no, I'm going up. A minotaur is a fearsome beast that <laughs> I might have some useful materials on it. A man is like, I go up. <laughs> As Amanda says, I'm going up and begins flying up. You, the rest, the the other two, the other two of you begin begin hearing, zoom, 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 oh. zoom, there approaching he extremely heavy footsteps. Oh. I wonder who that might be. just crawls into the corner of the ceiling. So Amanda, you break through the top of the foliage, and you see a pair of horns go marching, <sighs> marching through the top of the foliage, coming closer and closer to the position. Fun. I don't. I don't like it. I don't Poke, like it. I don't like it. Poke and Svara, as 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 you're standing there, as you're standing there next to next to the druid plants, bursting through the foliage comes a twenty foot tall minotaur. Oh hi, Mister Minotaur. <laughs> Look, looks at you. Looks at you with with red with red glowing eyes. The tops of his, the tops of his horns piercing the top of the top of of the the top of of the foliage cave. Looks down at you and snorts. <laughs> And uh, and and begin begins reaching down for poke. Roll initiative. Oh, oh, hello. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. oh he's looking for poke. Oh, sorry. Oh man. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, Mister. Um... <laughs> oh, I'm so really sorry, Mister. I didn't mean to upset you or anything, but um, why are you yelling at me? He's a tiny I rolled, bird size. I, I rolled. Oh, a, I rolled uh, a six oh, for oh, initiative. Oh, All right. No. A six. Uh, oh no. Uh. As, uh and so preemptively, uh, poke, uh, poke wild shapes into a worm, and then digs down into the soil. Okay. <laughs> There's no soil here. What? Yeah. There's no soil. You're on the moon. You're on moon slip. It's just amber crystal is the floor. All the plants are in planters. Oh. Uh, oh, so well I rolled initiative just in case. Um. Yep. Nineteen. Nineteen. Uh, so, and yeah, I, I rolled a, I rolled a five. Uh, also, so instead, maybe maybe instead of a worm, uh, maybe a, a maybe a mouse to crawl out of the way. Okay. No. Uh, how about how, you just stay normal? What, what sort life? of action? What sort of action does it take to wild shape? Bonus action for a uh, bonus action for circle of the moon. Uh, circle. A uh, bonus action for the cir uh, for circle of the moon. Uh, for circle of the moon. Uh, yeah. It, 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 okay. I uh, have that too. I thought you could only do bonus actions on your turn. Generally, yes. Okay. Oh, sorry. Uh, uh but the, but we're. Yeah, this is a weird. This is like a weird point. Like we're on the bridge of like starting combat, but yeah. Not... The, I what what I would the way I would rule this would be uh he would be Poke can do it on on his initiative. Uh, however, uh, Aman um, the initiative order is Amanda, Svara, Poke, and they rolled a 19 as well with, with Amanda. So, so, uh, the Minotaur, oh, so. so the Minotaur is going, is going to take an attack. Okay. 
Uh, and is going to attack Svara, actually. Oh, man. With a nat 20! Oh! <laughs> okay, um, I know I just leveled up. Um, hold on, let me look, let me look at, um, I remember my armor of hexes does something about this. Here. Mm -hmm. Um, oh, it has to be cursed by my hex blitz. Oh, well, okay. Mm -hmm. Let's be cursed. <laughs> well, all right. Okay, what's it gonna what's it gonna do to me? So it so it re it reaches forward and it punches you for Ow. fourteen points of damage. <clears throat> hey, touches hey, is a reaction. Punches, oh, Punch. punches. As a reaction, take is that double because of a crit or? Uh oh no oh you're right you're right uh that should actually I'm be a twenty eight points of damage. 28, you're right? Okay. 28 points of damage and you get and you get knocked you get knocked back 10 feet. Okay. Hold on. Uh, 28, uh, that takes you temporary hit points and then okay. Yeah, temporary hit points first. So you take 22 points of damage. Alright, down to 106. Uh, it knocks you back 10 feet, so, so it, so feet, it, yeah. it, so and it, as a reaction so, when yeah. that happens, um, Hellish rebuke, but it's okay. not hellish. Yes, it'd be celestial rebuke. Yeah, my, my, minus the hellish part. Um. So. Holy rebuke. Right. Um. I'm gonna just be like, you know what? I'm like, how rude of you. Boom. You know. Um. How rude of you. Roll some damage. Wait, I don't have to roll spell casting or anything. Uh, you should, yeah, whatever you, whatever you need to roll. Oh, okay, spellcasting. Da, 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 da. Now we gotta find oh, it. Sixteen. Okay. Uh, um, that's that's be that's below the below their saving throws. So, uh, so you or that's above their saving throws. So, right. so, uh, do you roll damage or they just take the same damage that they hit you with? Uh, I roll have to roll damage, and it okay. is. Um. Wait, hold on. So it is 60, 60 10 fire damage. 60 10 fire damage? Yeah. Holy yes. Shit. Roll, because okay. Roll Warlock damage. Spells, Warlock spell slots are fun. Roll damage. All right, 60 10. Uh, where's my d10? Here it is. Eight. One. Okay. Nine. So it's 18 in total. You can look at chat. Seven. It's 25 in total. Nine again. Uh. 25 nine, plus I, nine. I lost track. I lost track. 34. Uh, 25 plus nine is 34. And last roll is a one. So 35. 35. Fire. 35 points of damage. So you. So you, so you, but so you, but you, but as it as it punches you, you release just a gout of flame that singes that singes the fur across it across its ar its arm and chest. It bellows an unearth an unearthly bellow as you, as you go flying back into the it through in, through the disappearing through the foliage wall. It then turns it it then turns on turns on poke, and rolls a nat twenty to grapple. What? Oh. Oh my God, bro! Oh, oh hell my God! No, uh, man. I'll, Poke, I'll give I'll give you a chance a chance for an a, an acrobatics check to dodge, but you will need to roll a nat twenty to avoid the to avoid being grappled, my friend. And he's, no. he's yeah. probably gonna eat you. Oh! Oh no! Man. No, we don't like that. Wait. Bad, bad oh, yeah, boy. See, he's, he's rolling. We can't he's see rolling. it. We, just, we can't see it. He's rolling just to let us know. He's rolling. Wait, it's what blurred. Did you roll? It's blurred. It's blurred. I cannot see. I'm legally blind. <laughs> That's a 13, uh, it looks like. Uh, oh, wah, no. Wah, wah. Oh, no. Poke, the Minotaur, the Minotaur, the Minotaur gra grabs you. Grabs you I appreciate you uh, see, letting us see your roll, by the way. Crushes Thank you. crushes you in, it, in its hand for 24 points of damage. Oh, oh, oh. And, what? That, that, that's not even. That's not even half. Come on. And, <laughs> and pops you in its mouth like a gummy bear. 
<laughs> I'll save you. Ba -ba -da -da. <laughs> Next is Amanda. That's Amanda. Oh, do I see this go down? Because if so, uh, no. in the bunk. No, you are you are above the. You're above uh, above the fo the foliage up by up by the ceiling, so you see that you. Keep my head down to so see you, what's going on. You see the you see the the you see the minotaur's horns up above the up above the uh, the the foliage ceiling, then suddenly disappear, and you hear a boom, whoosh, and you and you see a burst of, a burst of hellish light from below, and then you then you and then you. Then you hear a and rock. Not hellish. Then you hear a rock. <laughs> that uh, uh, you hear a you hear a uh, you hear a bird-like shout that is cut off. All right, so I pull up my shillelagh, make sure it's on fire. Well, actually, no, I make sure it's on fire once I come down. Okay. So you I slowly it. descend. You slowly descend, or you're going to descend and drop on it? I'm I'm going to descend so I can see where it's at. Your head goes to the behind it, so I go to the back of its head. And then just like... Because -bum. <laughs> so, he don't know I'm there. So right right as you're about to go babunk, you see you see him you see it grab poke and, and swallow it, in it into its mouth. Swallow? Yes. yes. Okay, okay, you're in his stomach, stomach now. now. Ooh, well, a, this is a good position now. Well, he he's he grabs you and and he grabs you and 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 you are engulfed in his mouth. You're not swallowed yet, but you're engulfed. All right, let's go with that flame blade, Shalele, so, baby. Amanda, roll to hit. All right, let's go. All right, I'm going to go to the eighteen, and it, he doesn't know I'm there. Eighteen hits. Roll damage. All right, we're gonna first go with our shillelagh damage. So shillelagh damage eight. So and then do I roll for fire damage? Yes, you roll for fire damage as well. Okay, and then that would be well. Twelve plus eight is twenty points of damage. <laughs> you smack the. Okay. You, you you beat you beat, beat the bit you, you you smack the minotaur on the ba on the back of the head for twenty point for twenty points of damage, uh, uh, Svara. Uh, it is your it is your turn. You have you've just been knocked back ten feet through the through the foliage wall. Yeah. Um, Ow. Yes. Okay. Um, do I see, do I see that paladin has been unfortunately swallowed? No, you do not. Or eat, eat, eaten? Not okay. Not poke, 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 poke. poke. You do you um, do not. That that happened. That happens after after you were are knocked through the through the foliage wall. Yes. Okay. Um. Here's what we're gonna do. We are going to. How far away is he at, at this point? I mean, I just I only got knocked back ten feet, so I can just rush yeah. over there. I, yeah. Yeah. Um. Uh, we are going to. S we're gonna do the mini version of the mega attack. Okay. Let's just, let's just yeah. Um, we're not gonna, no prep round for this one because you know. Uh, we're gonna run over him. Uh, we're gonna searing smite. As a bonus action, and then as the normal action, we're gonna pass the grave, and then we're gonna action surge, giving us another action and another bonus action. Oh, oh my gosh. nice! And then we're gonna booming blade, right? And using my last warlock spell slot, it, it, on a hit, on, if that hits, of course. And we're gonna we'll wait until it hits, and on a hit we'll do the the fun stuff. Okay, roll, and that's just roll your the attacks. mini. I will. That's just the mini epic. This is oh yes, this is the this is the mini the mini time. I believe the maxi epic. Instead of the mega. Did, the I mega have rolled. Epic. I have rolled a twenty-one for attack. That hits. Sweet. Roll your damage. And on well, the I, hit. Well, actually, why don't you why don't you roll your why don't you roll your your second attack first and then roll all the damage at once. 
the second attack? Yeah, didn't you have a second? Isn't there a second attack for your second action? And your second no, bonus there, action? No, um, Path to the Grave is, like, activating. It's, another, it's, like, it's like another curse. It's like another, okay. like... So, yeah. it, it, so, so it's just a damage added. Yeah, well, okay. uh, Path to the Grave gives them <laughs> vulnerability to all, the, to the next attack that happens. So everything is doubled. Um, okay. So, we'll yeah. Some damage. Oh, and on a hit, I'm going to activate both Divine Smite and Eldritch Smite because they both have, uh, I both have, I have one last Warlock spell slot and one last Paladin, Paladin spell slot left. Oh, good gods. Okay, roll your damage. Now we're hungry. So that's, I'm, I'm going to use, I'm going to use the dice roller for this one just because, like, that's fine. it's, it's, it's too much to keep track of. It um, has 65 hit points left, so if you, if, uh -oh. if you, if you get over 65, then you can just describe your kill shot. I'm pretty sure this is gonna do. I'm way pretty over sure it's that. gonna. I'm pretty sure you're gonna be over it. But go ahead. But yep. Go ahead and roll it real quick anyway. Yeah. Um. Let's do this. Anyways, you're gonna watch him just single-handedly kill a Minotaur, Antonio. Not single-handedly. With me in it. Well, yes. He's gonna go Kamehameha. 2d8. The Paladin Warlock combo. Yes. Um, Warlock, Warlock. Eldritch Smite. That is. <laughs> six more, six more, like D8s. Six six more D8s. D8s. Six more D8s. <laughs> my god. Um, Divine Smite is. And Eldritch Smite, goddamn. Two more D8s. Wait, no, that's... Yeah, two more D8s. Plus also uh, the Searing Smite. I didn't do that, that one yet. Um, when you cast a spell, initial damage to uh, 1d6. First spell slot. Two more D6s. Good God. And... Also, yep, that looks like it's it, and that's 63 damage, plus it's all doubled, so... Wow. That's, uh... Doubled? 126 damage. So, describe your kill shot, my friend. 126! Describe, describe what you do to this, what you do to this 20-foot-tall minotaur with poke in its mouth. Sparrow rushes forward out of the foliage <laughs> with the with the great axe in both hands and just slices the minotaur th th like from the stomach and just slices it in half and just like just cleaves it right through and it, it like it's like butter it just goes right through it's like butter the minotaur the minotaur the minotaur falls and that and as it as it falls the shock of its head falling its mouth opens up and poke comes poke comes ro comes rolling out soaked in minotaur spit yeah you want to bathe off in the their water oh my gosh if she, if, if wait so if savara had it first round and just decided to do that first round he could have just killed him one shot yeah that's the entire the minotaur goal. originally had 110 yeah, that's the entire build of this character. Um, with heck, with if I rolled a crit, um, with Path of the Grave, um, which it crits on a 19 instead of, or it crits on a 19 and 20. So if I rolled a 19 or 20, um, I would have crit and dealt another 20, another double damage, which more have quadrupled the damage instead of only the double. And I also didn't have my angel form out, which would have done like 10 ish damage. Um, plus Hexblade's Curse does more, like, I need to make sure my animation, my animation skills are on point when you do that but kind of battle. Now I'm all out of, that's the downside of this character. Now I'm all out of spell slots, and... and now you're basically just like, oh, I need a yeah, no, yeah, I'm just like, now I'm just like, I have an axe that can do some good damage, and I can fly. Sometimes. Mm. That's... I mean, yeah. That's the entire build. It's a boss killer. 
Yeah, they they expect like one they expect, hit baby. They they Odin figured out a figured out a way to uh, to use to use every spell slot that he has all in one shot through act through action through the the multi classing action economy. action surge action surge best my boy. So, All right. Well, we have so five Sva more minutes. So Svara Sva Sva annihilate, annihilates the <laughs> annihilates the the, the, the Minotaur, uh, and uh, which releases which releases Poke, uh, the the four the four uh, the the four the four the four plants are are now happily uh, are now ha are now happily continuing their continuing their uh, continuing their dance, and. Uh, and are uh, and are and are continuing to grow into a circle. Um, so Poke, I, I was about I was about to say, what are the how are the plants going to react to their uh, 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 to uh, to who they were calling like their uh, 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 their their father uh, uh, being brutally annihilated in front of them? Uh, well, they they're. they're uh, they're in the middle of they're in the middle of uh, of create of creating their circle, so they're not really paying attention to much else. But uh, but poke as you as you are as you are uh, as you are released from from the Minotaur's mouth, you tu you tumble over and you're like, <coughs> and you look you look over and you see the magical energy building building in the in the circle of the. Uh, in the circle of of the uh, the circle of the plants. Does somebody try and find Tenerife and Shakti and like uh, bring them over here or not? Oh, girl, we are way too far in. We are True. knee deep now. Right, no, no, so, we, were, uh, we were knee deep when we went when we entered this place. Now we're like uh, now we're up to here. Neck deep. <laughs> And the man is uh, just like, are you talking about your type of neck deep or my type of neck deep? Is anyone, uh, are, are you guys going to uh, search the Minotaur at all? I think I want Let's to very him. badly. Okay. So, so you, you, you loot him and you, fi and you find a, and you find a druid spell scroll. Oh, of, of this, of the spell called Chloroplast. Gimme, 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 gimme. No, that's that's for Poke. That's for gimme. Poke. That's the whole reason he even thought of this place. Because it was on the Minotaur. Very smart. I want it, though. It's stupid. Also, it's oh, horns. Oh. I would like to take my axe and just chop one off. I want okay. one, too. So, so, Svar so Svara ta takes her axe and, cho and chops one of the chops one of the one of the minotaur's horns off as a trophy amanda flies over to the minotaur's head and just and just breaks the breaks the horn off off of off off of the minute the minotaur's skull and holds it up as a yeah, trophy this is a good meat cuff kratos killing helios style uh, it's like then uh then po poke is poke, poke is sitting there like huh, 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 and a little sheet of paper goes whoosh, Lands on the ground in front of him, and there's your chloroplast spell that you were looking for. Well then, uh. Oh, yeah. I have a dagger and venom. All right, I've got, I've got, I've got the thing I was looking for. Um, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm going to read it, but not cast it. Okay, you may add the spell chloroplast to your spell book. Can I look at what that what level is? It? I'm gonna look at what. The uh, let's look yeah, it up. Like... I'm I'm not sure what it does what it does in five e because the last time I used it was in two e. Oh, it's not a it is not a five e spell. I can't find it anywhere. I don't see anything either. Yeah, I can't. I can't find it anywhere. Huh. Uh. Well. Uh. What would it be under? For spells. You might be thinking of something different. Oh wait, I'm going. I actually think I have an idea on how we can figure it out. And Tanya, I'm going to come over to your room a little bit and take over your um, your, 
uh, Perry's handbook, whichever one holds the spells. Uh, yeah, so uh, it is apparently not a D&D &D spell, so I'm going to homebrew this for you. Uh, this, Chloroplast is, is a spell which, as long, well, which is uh, while the target, it, while the target of the spell is in sunlight, they regenerate 1d6 hit points per round. Oh, cool. Is it? Uh, while the target that you cast it on is in sunlight, they get they regain they regenerate one d six hit points per round. Oh, that's very flavorful. Oh, it's like they one. get the chloropass. That's really that's really cool. What what is in what level of spell is it? Uh, it starts at second level, and when you cast it at when you start it when you cast it at fourth level, uh, it gains plus one plus one die per level of spell slots. So. You get you get three d you get uh, you get three d six at level four, four d six at level five, so on. Wow, that's really unique. It's underneath druid spells, right? Yes. Okay, I'm just find druid. Okay. Wait, and what level is it? Second level. D fours. D six. Yeah. There's there's nothing showing it in here. Very, very cool. I like, I like this spell. Okay. So the the spe the, the spell, uh, it's it's one d one d six when you cast it at second level, and it gets and it it's one d six for a third level spell slot as well, uh, but a fourth level spell slot gives you three d six. A fifth level spell slot gives you four d six, and so on. Oh, I'm going to head out. Okay. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're pretty much done. I was just going to say that the spell come the spell comes kind of like comes kind of like drifting down in front in front of Poke. He looks up and says, "Oh, hey, it's a it's, <laughs> it's a spell," and that's yeah. where, where we'll that's where we'll pause for the evening. Sweet. I was trying to give Little. you guys some combat. You guys ran away three oh, times. Wait, really? Yeah. Oh, right. With the with the the draining. I didn't know how to fight the draining life guy. Because like, they would just absorb all of our attacks. Yeah, all of our all of our stuff is like energy based. So I don't know what yeah. would what would have hurt him. You know. An axe. An axe has kinetic energy when it hits. That. That, that it. it it was light. It was light that that oh, healed them. Okay. okay. Because they're light drinkers. It. Right. I, I I thought it was just like a general energy drinker or something like that. Well, you you didn't try you didn't try any other any other energies. But where did we run away? Where did we run away from? What else did we run away from? Uh, you you ran away you ran away from the from the from the life drinkers. Uh, you ran away. You ran away from the. Uh, uh, what was it? What was that? What was that? The at the very end of the of the ship. Oh, um, you had a ch you had a chance to uh, you had a chance to uh, to shoot at to shoot spells at the gnomish ship. Oh really? Oh, out with the, the cannon. Oh. Out, out, well, you you could have taken over the cannon, or you could have shot out the windows. You could have shot spells out the windows of the back of the ship. Oh, that would have sucked us into space. No. Right. Oh, okay. No, you can ca you can cast spells through windows and stuff, as long as you're okay. not like, you know, hacking yeah, yeah, through yeah. the window. You know, you can. Oh, okay. You can cast a, you can cast spells through windows and stuff. As long as there's not a, as long as there's not a physical component like like fireball, you have the seed that you throw, and so for that you would need you'd need a porthole like the like what the cannon shoots out of. Yeah. I'm glad I um, got to demonstrate uh, sort of what, like like a mini a mini version of what of what Spara can do. Um, but now I have to go sleepy. Yep. Well, you'll get you'll get a chance to you'll get a chance to rest before you do anything else, depending on the depending on the choices that you guys make next session. If well, any of us, if any of us are even here next session. Yeah. <laughs> um. Uh uh, how long does uh, how long does the chloroplast last? Uh, it lasts for uh, ten rounds. Ah, huh. and it does that much healing for. Uh, uh, 
it does that much healing as long as you're in sunlight, right? Yes. Alrighty, I'm going to stop the video. So thank you for thank you for watching Atlanteon. Good night. <laughs>